it's a new day today, and I actually, if you guys saw in a, in a couple vlogs, a few vlogs ago, um, when I was at Demolition Ranch with Matt, um, we tried to do a, a, a beer opening video with the, uh, with the Desert Eagle. We used some powerful rounds, we used a 44, we used 50 AE. So today, rather than scrapping that video for the drinks channel, Brandon and I decided to try to change things up a little and see if we can get this thing to work. So today, I'm going to head out to um, my parents' house in Calabasas to try a few other things. Hopefully, we can get this to work. And yeah, I just got back from the gym um, a few minutes ago. So I got to take a shower, get ready, and then we're going to head out and have ourselves a good day, like we always do. I'm back at my parents' house now, and I wanted to show you guys something. When I was really young, like when I was a baby, I had bright blonde hair and bright blue eyes. Look at this. You can see here. Yeah, how weird is that? Blonde hair, blue eyes, and then I and then I turned into this. It's like I was born Aryan and um, became Jewish. But this is cool. This is a picture of my dad. These two are my dad. And these two are my mom. That's cool. And then I had a Joe Dirt haircut. Look at that mullet. God, I'm wearing overalls and that mullet is just, that is crazy. See, there's my bright blue eyes again. Crazy, crazy. We realized that we didn't have, I forgot to bring the openers. By the way, I'm with this doofus. Who? <laughs> uh, I realized I forgot to bring the openers, which is the only thing we like, I mean, we needed everything else, but that's such a, a loss for us to not have that, because uh, we need it. So now we're at Ralph's looking to see if they have the kind of openers we need, which I hope, and then we can get to shooting this video. We couldn't find the openers at Ralph's, so we ended up going to another grocery store called Albertsons, and they had a ton of them. So we got, we got a bunch of them, but I was just showing Brandon, this guy here, this gigantic teddy bear. I actually was going to buy one of these. My dad and I were talking about this idea where we'd cut open the back of it, get inside, and, ha and be walking like this giant, you know, stuffed animal and be able to get up after sitting down and like chase people and do stuff that's fun like that. Literally, the next day after talking about it, um, we saw Dennis Rohde's new video was getting into this and walking around with it, which I thought was hilarious. It's not something that's like, oh, damn it. Just like, okay, well, he did it faster. But uh, I want you guys to see the actual size of this thing. Just to give you guys an idea of the, si of the size, Brandon is 6'4", and this thing is so much taller. I need a bay this big. <laughs> and it's not, you're not even holding him straight up, but. No, I'm not, he's too heavy. His head's super heavy, yeah. But what do you, what do you think, like seven foot? Definitely. Yeah, definitely like seven, seven foot teddy bear, but a use him right Abby now. loves him. This is a cuddly teddy bear. I actually have never sighted in my 22, so we just, the 22 is right there. We're just sighting it in on that black board. We got this because that's a full hill behind it, so. Um, it's actually a lot steeper than it looks from here because we're staying at the bottom of the hill But any any bullets going straight will go straight into that hill um, And so we don't have to worry about it just going off into the distance because obviously that's super dangerous Got my ear protection and my eye protection. We're gonna try to continue this uh, opening a beer experiment this time. We're gonna be doing it with um, A 22 so let's see if it works. So we got to bend these openers. That's probably good like that. Yeah, that's perfect. So we got these openers here, and then we're propping up this beer bottle with these two tennis balls and that little stick to keep it from rolling down. So hopefully we can get this to work. We got the GoPro shots. <sighs> Let's do this. This is how you open a beer bottle with a 22. I didn't think the 22 would be that powerful, but it literally sliced this thing in half like it was butter. Damn. Let's try this again. We tried again, and I'm not gonna tell you guys what happened. You'll just have to go to the drink video to find out, which the link is in the description below. So make sure you check that out, show it some love, and uh, yeah. But uh, it, was still, it's, it was still a really fun video to shoot, so I'm really proud of it. 
regardless of how it turned out, so you guys will see. But um, yeah, so make sure you check that out. Right, you had fun? It was a good video, you guys will enjoy it. I just found something that was funny. It's it's the shows how, how much I grew up. I just found this. This is all dusty and everything. Still has airsoft BBs in it. Super dusty. And then I graduated to firearms. <laughs> it's only the natural progression. So those of you parents that are wondering if buying your kids airsoft guns are going to turn into them wanting real guns. Hell yeah. Because they're awesome. Jake and I decided to go out for St. Patrick's Day. I'm not wearing any green. I think that's all I got for you. Mr. Harvey is already asleep. Look at that. Look at that sexy leg right there. That's his chicken leg. Yeah, dude. And he tucks his head. <laughs> Just tucking it back. You are so weird, dude. Anyway, um, I made sure to come back so that I can fully edit the drink video and make sure I have time to edit this vlog that you guys are watching. And uh, I did. I got everything done and I am happy and I, it's, it's now... 1.50 in the morning, 10 to 2, so um, it sh I should go to sleep. I have stuff to do in the morning. So please go down to the description and click on that drink video. Check it out. Let me know what you think. Share it with your friends. Show it some love. I'm just, I'm happy to do those videos. They're, so, they're a lot of fun to do. And I like, now I like to come up with different creative ideas of trying different things. So we'll have some fun with that. And, uh, and on that note, that's all I got, so I will see you guys again soon. Goodbye. <laughs>